We are off to a very nice start this morning. Just a little bit chilly, but really not seeing too much cloud cover. Also not seeing any rain over the past several hours. Radar has been keeping us totally dry, and that's how we're going to be staying for the rest of today. Not expecting any rain to move into the area. Temperatures, though, a little bit chilly. 35 right now in Greenville with the winds coming out of the east at 5 miles an hour. Over in a Greenwood, just a couple degrees lower still. 33 in Greenwood. Also seeing winds out of the east, though, at 5 miles an hour this morning. Zooming out just a little bit, there's several areas still in the lower 30s. Batesville still in the lower 30s west of the river. We have 30 in Pine Bluff, 33 in Monticello, Arkansas, 31 down in El Dorado. And then the further south you go, it does get just a little bit higher. 38 in Jackson, 39 right now in Vicksburg. So we are going to be keeping these dry and mostly sunny conditions around with us for the rest of the morning. So not expecting any activity to move in for this morning or for this afternoon. And that's all because of this high pressure. That area of high pressure will continue to bring down that northerly and that easterly wind flow. That's going to help keep us mostly sunny and dry. But then as we go on into the overnight hours, we will bring in about a 20% chance for just a few very light showers after midnight. Also increasing our cloud cover just a little bit. Then for early tomorrow morning, so Christmas morning, I think most areas, if not all areas, it will stay dry, but we will still keep in that 20% chance just for a few light showers for Christmas morning and for the rest of Christmas Day. Then moving on into Tuesday night and early Wednesday morning, I think a lot of areas will still remain dry, but then that rain chance for Wednesday afternoon, that will begin to increase just a little bit as we have a few showers form out ahead of that main line that's going to be moving through during the day on Thursday. As that activity moves through on Thursday, that could leave us with some heavy rainfall at times. Also going to leave us with the chance for some thunderstorm potential. Once again, that's going to be on Thursday. Temperatures for the rest of today a little bit lower than yesterday. 51 starting out the afternoon, 55 at 2 o'clock. We'll be at 54 by 4 and 47 as we go on into the start of the evening. Once again, though, mostly sunny and dry conditions today, and that's how we're going to be staying tonight for the most part. Most areas will be staying dry, only about a 20% chance for a few light showers after midnight. We are going to bring in just a little bit more cloud cover, though. That's going to leave us with partly cloudy skies overnight. Otherwise, low temperatures right at 40. Tomorrow increasing about 20 from the low, 60 for the high tomorrow. Partly sunny, 20% chance again for a few light isolated showers. Winds will be out of the south, southeast tomorrow at 5 miles an hour. Conditions though right here on your 7-day forecast are going to begin to change up quite a bit. Wednesday, more cloud cover moving in. 30% chance for some showers during Wednesday late afternoon. 65 for the high on Wednesday and then Thursday. That's going to be the bigger day, mostly cloudy. As that activity moves through, that will leave us with about a 90% chance for some showers. Some of this rainfall could be heavy at times. Also looking at the potential for some thunderstorm activity on Thursday. High temperatures right at 70, only dropping down a little bit for Friday. 65 on Friday, mostly sunny, 20% chance for some isolated light showers. Down to the mid-50s on Saturday and low 50s by Sunday.